I, Nicholas William Safford, do solemnly swear to support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I will obey the orders of the President of the United States and the orders of the officers appointed over me according to regulations and the uniform code of military justice. So help me God. So just real quick, everybody wants to introduce this guy, not me. Um, big day for a, a freaking outstanding uh, staff sergeant promoted to gunnery sergeant, and I expect him to continue uh, on the path that got him here. Um, true jack of all trades, been able to tackle, I don't know, 10, 20, 30 different things at once, and uh, see them all through to completion. Um, understands uh, how important everything that uh, Motor T Ops and Maintenance does here. Uh, what they do uh, really keeps this engine moving, and uh, he moves the ball every single day. I mean, just look at the place where you're standing right now. Freaking 12 months ago, night and day. Looks amazing in here. And that's uh, thanks to everybody that uh, gives 110% every day for this great uh, gunner start right here. So, very well deserved. Glad we have you for hopefully a couple more years as a freaking motivated gunner start now. I uh, expect, uh, you know, nothing but uh, bigger and better things for you. All right, all right. So I like to thank everybody in the back for, for coming out. All right, now I like to thank all the Marines that are here today. I'm gonna keep it simple. You know me. I like to talk. I can talk a lot. But one thing I'm gonna talk about, the three things I'm gonna talk about, is God, core, and country. Right. So there's a there's a really good book that maybe you should check out. But inside that book it says, "If a man remains in me and I in him, he will bear much fruit. Apart from me, he can do nothing." Right? We are not alone in this. We are brothers and sisters in this organization, but please believe there is a higher power at work. The next thing is the core, commitment to the core. I stand in front of you today as a guardian sergeant because I made that commitment years ago to the Marine Corps. 
I'm willing to get dirty. I'm willing to go where the Marine Corps sent me. I'm willing to take on anything that the Marine Corps has to throw at me. And you can do the same thing too. But it's all done with your commitment and your sacrifice that you have. And then the last thing that I have is the country. There are millions of people out there that are counting on us every single day to show up and do our job. And that's all we have to do. The orders and regulations are in place. It's pretty simple. I joined when I was 21 years old, and this has been the easiest job, right? I do it with a smile on my face every single day, no matter what adversity we face. That's all I got. I appreciate you guys for coming out here. You rock.